I'm so proud to be speaking to you today on behalf of the Chain National Organization and the Chain Community in the UK to show our solidarity with you and to support for your struggle today. Of course, as the Chain people, we share the same goal to be free from this dictatorship and to live in a democracy. We want to protect our culture, our customs, and we want to speak our language freely and teach it in our schools as well. We also want to free from attack by the Burmese military whenever these soldiers come to our places, homelands or villages. They torture our people. They kill the same as you are suffering today. And they steal our belongings. They rape our women and children. And they destroy our heritage and identity. Meanwhile, the Gachin are forced to change a border guard and was given a deadline by the gender. We don't want war. These Burmese army military troops should immediately withdraw not only from the current stakes today but also from all the ethnic nationalities area. Today, we the Chain people stand by you. Many times, over many years, we have fought side by side for our freedom. When we look at our history, in World War II, the Chain and Karen fought together against the Japanese when they invaded to our lands. And in 1949, when the Korean people started, stood up arms to defend themselves against attack by the central Burmese government, the Qing war hero No Seng refused the order from Hunu to attack against the Korean ethnic people. In 1960, the Kachin Independence Organization joined the National Liberation Alliance, which was founded by the Korean National Union. And in 1976, the Kachin Independence Organization also joined National Democratic Front, where 12 ethnic nationalities, parties, including KNU, joined together in order to achieve its ultimate game, aims or goals of a genuine federalism for all the ethnic nationalities in Burma. And why the chain was forced into the ceasefire in 1994? The human rights abuses and violations did not end, nor did our resistance. stopped resisting the dictatorship and we never will. Today, we all must continue to work together side by side to achieve our joint dream of a peaceful federal democratic Obama. Today, we can also call together with you on the UK government and the United Nations to give more attention to these attacks against the Korean people, to take action to end up them, and to set up commission of inquiry into these crime against humanity and war crimes being committed by the Burmese military dictatorship. And finally, put Tan Shui in jail cell where he belongs. Free Korean people. Free all the ethnic people in Burma and free Burma. Thank you. Thank you so much for the speech, Madam. Now I would like to request Uzo Boa, who is former political prisoner and.